What's well, up? I got a package here from Seth, aka Basketball Card. And I bet his name implies what's in this package. Because it's a basketball card. Awesome. Um, these are mystery packs. I got two of them. Did pretty well. Um, don't know if I can get into these. Wow. Those are made very oh, Next time, use a team bag, man. You won't need all this tape. Team bag. Hold all these just the same. We're getting in today, I know we are. I feel it. Alright, this will be good. Oh my goodness. Okay. Nice tape job. Oh my goodness. Alright. One of my main hits with this Paul Pierce Jersey Auto out of 100. What's funny is I was with him when he got this at a card show. My other hit was a Isaiah Thomas auto from National Treasures. I believe this is short printed to wow ten. Rondo, jumbo jersey from National Treasures. We got a Al Horford auto. Final signs. Oh, is okay. Randy Foy. Superscripts and Carl Laundry. <laughs> Landry. Out of 825. So thanks for that. Mystery pack. Basketball card. Next one, this, this has got to be eBay because I'm expecting a lot of eBay stuff and I haven't really seen too much of it today. Oh, yep, this is a base card, National Treasures of Rodman. It's just the one out of 99, nothing special. I don't fish that he's got the one number to five, I think. So that makes fish daddy cooler than me. That's eBay. All right, I think this last one is it the last one? It is the last one, unless I get some mail later today. But yeah. Last one. This one is from everyone's favorite YouTuber, Mr. NBA Card Collector. Now, a lot of people have said that he's a scammer, and I proposed a trade to him. One, he had a card I really wanted, and two, I wanted to give him the chance to show people that he is not a scammer. Maybe, you know, he misled some people on eBay. Um... But uh, I offered a trade to him. He said yes. He had a card I really wanted. And he sent it. Sent it pretty good packing, too. He stuck a used bulb mailer. I guess he couldn't really just send that. So he put it inside a uh, card envelope. And I got my card. So I'm saying, you know, if you want to trade with him, as far as this goes, you know, he came, he came right with my trade, so I don't know. You guys decide. I mean, I'd, I'd definitely do another trade with him. Uh, he threw in this for me, an Austin Day rookie card. So appreciate the extra. Where's my Austin Day? Okay, and then this is the card I traded for. I've never even seen this card until he showed it to me. Um, this is a really nice card. It's all manufactured patch. You got the Logo Man, Draft New York, Go 09. And it's the autograph. Number to 125. It's from Prestige. So thanks, Mr. NBA Card Collector. Um, yeah, so I, 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 I would definitely trade with him again. Um, you guys can make up your own minds. I know there's a couple rants on there about him, but, you know, I, I trust him. I would do a trade with him again. So if anyone wants to 
um, talk to me about it like if you're not sure if you should trade or not go ahead and talk to me I'll tell you go ahead because he definitely came through for me so thanks mister collector thanks to Seth Chun Fritz Freddy Vu uh, Toyota Tony Rick eBay uh, Kevin Draper man I'm so many people sent me so much stuff over the last two weeks so again if I have a trade going on with you or I said uh, wait till I get home and I'll make a list of something holler at me because uh, man my, my brain is fried I don't even know what to do next I'm gonna go to the post office and mail out some cards that I owe some people and uh, yeah we'll get back to ya